Let me explain what attributes of the axe handle give it such superior performance over a round handle bat. There are really four attributes to the design that give it all of its benefits. The first is that the bottom hand is on an oval shape that extends out into the pinky. We did a lot of research on grip strength and what's going to give you the greatest amount of grip strength with the least amount of muscle tension. This is really pivotal for how the axe handle gives you better performance. The shape of the offset oval that pushes out into that pinky and keeps the handle on the fingertips allows you to have the maximum amount of grip with the least amount of tension in your forearms and hands. What that means is that you're spending less energy and strength gripping the bat and you have more strength available for swinging the bat and accelerating the barrel through the zone. Another key part of that was that the hands have to move independently of each other through the swing. You don't want your hands locked into the same position. They need to be able to dynamically move. This is what allows you to get that dynamic power transfer from the bottom of your feet all the way through your body, palms of your hand, out to the point on the barrel where you're impacting the ball. The next attribute is the angle of the bottom. If you look at the way your hand is when your wrist is in a neutral position, it's not perpendicular to the rest of your arm. It's got a slight angle. We've matched that angle with the bottom of the ax, and what that does is it puts your wrist in a more neutral position, allowing it to have a greater in-plane rotation and more power transfer. The last and possibly most significant part of the ax handle is the fact that it has a flush backside. If you look at the back of the ax bat, it's almost a straight line from the top of the grip all the way off to the end of the bat. What that allows the axe to do is create a contiguous contact between your hand and the bat. This takes away the impingement and the stress risers that a round handle bat put in your hand and again allow you to grip the bat less tightly but still be able to generate more power which translates to more power transfer out at the end of the bat.